Hi everyone, welcome back. We'll be covering how to spawn the asteroids and handle collisions, and how to make them behave in a random way. Let's start. Let's move into the asteroids, add a new sprite object, name it asteroids, right click the animation frames bar to import our frames. In this case we have 4 sprites for the asteroids, you can have as many as you want, but place the bigger ones at the beginning of the sequence. Set the animation speed to 0, check for the collision polygon, you can right click and select guest polygon shape, and check origin point at the center. Add the wrap, rotate, and bullet behavior. In this case, set the rotate speed to 90, set bullet speed to 100, and set angle to no. Go to the On the Start of Layout event and destroy the asteroid. Create an object that will serve as spawners for the asteroids. They won't be seen, so just give it a solid color and place it in the corner. Control drag to copy and rotate them towards the center of the screen. At this event, system every two seconds. Pick random instance. This will pick randomly one of the four spawners we have. System, create object, asteroid, add spawner X and spawner Y. This means that every 2 seconds the, the system will select one of the 4 spawners and create an asteroid in its position. We know that it's working, so let's place the spawners outside the screen. The asteroid created is now the active object, so you can assign properties directly to it. Asteroids, set angle of motion, spawner angle. This way the asteroid will move to the direction the spawner is facing. Since all the spawners were rotated to face the center of the screen, all the asteroids will move towards the center of the screen too. At another event, to set the rotation speed to a random value from 10 to 90, and edit the angle of motion to this expression. A spawner, angle of motion, plus random minus 30, column 30. So if the spawner angle was, for example, 45 degrees, now the asteroid will move in a range from 
15 to 75 or a little less than that degrees. Also set the bullet speed to random 50 to 100. So now the asteroids behave in a less predictable way. Now set frame to choose 0 or 1. Choose will only pick a value from the, op from the options given. In this case frame 0 or frame 1, which are the sprites for the big asteroid. Let's go the collisions now. Bullet, on collision with another object, asteroids. Destroy bullet and destroy asteroid. Also, when the ship collides with the asteroid, destroy the ship. and also destroy the thrust. Then to respond to ship, go to system, wait one second, this is just a pause, then create object, ship at 400 and 300, which is the middle of the screen, Then ship, spawn another object, thrust, at image point thrust, and thrust pin to ship. In the next video, we'll be breaking the asteroids into smaller pieces, so see ya!